Hey everybody, I'm doing DCI Trivia 2010 and up. I said I would do it years ago. I'm finally getting to it now. We're in my Bridgman 2007. I guess that's not 2010 and up. This is when I marched Bridgman 2007. Um, anyway, I tried to do this just like I did the other ones. I was like, all right, here we go. I had the camera on and everything. Honestly, it was a little too easy. I'm sorry, these are a little too fresh in my mind and I wasn't challenged, it wasn't fun, and so I'm doing this for you instead. So I won't be guessing. I've curated uh, a bunch of shows that uh, I will have you guessing and there's a point system I've come up with uh, so you can actually test yourself. So get a pen and paper, I'm gonna explain how the point system works. So just like the other ones, I will play a little clip of audio and if you know it right off the bat, all you need to know is the year and the core, just from that clip of audio then you get 10 points. So I play a little bit, 10 points. Uh, if you know the placement, you get a bonus point, you get 11 points. If you know the placement and uh, the exact score, uh, you get four bonus points. So uh, you could either get 10 points if you know the year and the core, you can get 11 points if you know the year, the core, and the placement. Uh, I assume you'll also know the show title, so that's not actually worth extra points. Um, and if you know everything down to the score, you get actually 14 points. Now if you don't know any of that, that's okay because we go on to the second part of that round which is uh, I will tell you the show title. So if, if you didn't know the first round or you were wrong, uh, then you get a second shot and you're like, oh I actually know what it is. That one's worth five points. So for example, I play a little audio clip and maybe you don't know it, okay. Then I say Metamorph. And now a bunch of you, okay I got it, that's worth five points, okay. Let's say you still don't know, I don't know the show Metamorph, okay. The next round, I will say uh, 2017 uh, first place, and then uh, we already heard Metamorph, so 2017 first place Metamorph. All you have to know is the core, that's worth three points. And if you still don't know it, I'm going to actually play a video clip of the end of the show. Conquered Blue Devils. Uh, and all you have to know is the core again, so now you actually get to see it, and so now if you know Blue Devils, that's worth one point. All right, let's ease into it. Here's the first one. This is kind of a gimme for a lot of us, but uh, I want to test the system out. So get your papers ready. Here's the first one. One would it get one? Would it get two? Some three. Win. The sailboat thousand and nine. It could get hundred for it is fifty. It could get the railroad for these workers. All these are the days, my friends. Will it get some rain for the sailboat? And it could get one. It is. It could get the railroad for these workers. And it could get. Alright, so uh, if you know the core and the year, you get 10 points. If you know the core of the year and the placement, you get 11 points. If you know the core of the year, the placement, and the uh, exact score they got, 14 points. Go ahead and write it down. If you're wrong, you're going to have to scratch it out, and then it'll be really sad for all of us. Uh, Alright. Round one is over. Round two. The show is called E equals MC squared. Okay, if that, oh, I know what that is, year and the core, you get five points now. Okay, so now if you're like, I know it, you write it down, five points, okay? Round three, uh, the year is 2013 and the placement is first. Now all you need to know is the core, so if you know uh, E equals MC squared first place 2013, if you know what core that was, you get three points. And now that round is over and finally, we get to enjoy the end of it. All you need to know, all you need to figure out is the core. If you guess it from uh, this video, you get one point.
Of course, it's Carolina Crown. If you didn't know it till the end, that's all right. You still get one point. If you still didn't know it, that's all right. Thanks for joining us. Uh, we're gonna keep trucking on. The warm-up's over. Now we're getting into it. This is one of my favorite starts because it's so non-traditional. Uh, again, 2010 and up. Let's see what you got. So again, if you know that show, uh, the year and the core, 10 points. If you know the placement, 11 points. If you know the exact score, 14 points. Write it down. That round is over. The show is called The Spark of Invention. Uh, so if you know it now, the year and the core, five points. Round is over. We're moving right along. So this is uh, 2015. Again, uh, Spark of Invention, 2015 fifth place. So if you know who did uh, the 2015 show, The Spark of Invention, and got fifth place, you get three points. And if you still don't know what Core did it, here is a little taste. So that was, of course, Santa Clara Vanguard. Uh, we had to throw them in because they're going to win this year. Oh, did I say that? I did. Uh, all right, uh, moving right along. Those ones didn't have brass at the beginning. This is a much more exciting intro. I think you're going to like it. I don't think you're going to know it. It's a very underrated show. Here we go. <laughs> Okay, 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 do you know it? 10 points. I got goosebumps. Mmm, I couldn't stop it, I'm sorry. This video is gonna be long. 10 points if you know it, core and the year. Uh, again, 11 points if you know the placement. 14 points if you know core, year, placement, and score. Okay, the show is called Reframed. So if that jogs your memory, five points. That round's over. So if you don't know the core and the year yet, uh, the year is 2012, and the placement is ninth, ninth place in 2012 with the show Reframed. Who was it? If now you know, you get three points. And if you still don't know... It's the Madison Scouts. Uh, so if you got it from that video, you get one point. 
Uh, moving along, uh, but not really moving along, because let's just talk about that for a second. Come on! Scouts are badass! Yeah, even even recent scouts are badass. People give them some flack, but whew, that's a drum corps right there. All right, now moving along. Uh, here we go. Do you know it? Ten points. Do you know the show? Uh, the the core, the year, and the placement. That's eleven points. The year, the core, the placement, the score. That's fourteen points. If you don't, that's okay. Cause I'm gonna tell you right now. The show is called Wicked Games. Oh, you know it now, do you? If so, five points. If not, that's okay. Uh, it's a really great show. I promise you. And it was my favorite from. Last year, 2017, sixth place. So if you know it now, the sixth place drum corps of 2017 playing the show Wicked Games. If you know what core that is, that's three points for you right there. And if not, that's okay, because we're going to get a little taste right now. <laughs> The Boston Crusaders. Uh, this is uh, a, a rising star in the drum corps community, a top six drum corps, and we're all super excited about it. Uh, so if you got that uh, before I said it, that's one point. All right, here we go. Moving on to another fan favorite. <laughs> first hit. Uh, if you know it, 10 points. If you know the core and the year uh, and the placement, that's 11 points. If you know the core, the year, the placement, and the exact uh, score, that's 14 points. If you don't, that's okay. Uh, the show is called A uh, or The, maybe none, Drum Corpse Bride. I don't think it's A. Uh, maybe A Drum Corpse. I don't know. Drum Corpse Bride. Not core. Corpse. It's a little play on words, a little play on everything. Really fun. 
Obviously. Do you know who it was? Do you know what year? If so, that's five points. If not, that's okay. I'm gonna tell you right now. Uh, it was 2016, 11th place. So who got 11th place in 2016 with the show Drum Corpse Bride? If you know the core, you get three points. If not, that's okay. Because you're gonna see them right now. It's the Academy! Uh, we were all super excited when they made it into finals. Uh, it was really energetic, and the drum corps community really loves it when we have a new contender. More great drum corps is more great drum corps. We all really love it. Uh, so that was awesome! That's a good place to stop. Uh, do you know it? 10 points. Uh, the core and the year. Do you know the core, the year, and the placement? That's 11 points. Do you know the core, the year, the placement, and the exact score? That's 14 points. Write it down. If not, that's okay. Uh, it was a show called Between Angels and Demons. If you're going, oh, that's what that is. It's blah, 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 blah. You get five points. The year and the core. If you don't know, that's okay. Uh, because I'm going to tell you right now, it was 2011, and it was the first place core. This is a gold medalist core right here. 2011 first place. Who got first place in 2011 with the show Between Angels and Demons? Do you know? If so, if you know the core, you get three points. If not, that's okay, because uh, you're going to check it out right now. <laughs> Cadets! Of course it's the Cadets. This show uh, is my favorite from a design standpoint uh, of all time. It's mind-blowing to think how they put that together with the different colored uniforms, with people coming in and out, you know how it is throughout the season. Blows my mind every time I see it. It never gets less amazing. Let's move on to the final round! <laughs>
I bet most of you do. Uh, if you know it, it's 10 points. If you know uh, the core and the year and the placement, that's 11 points. If you know the core, the year, the placement, and the exact score, you got yourself 14 points. If you don't, that's okay. Because uh, I'm going to tell you right now, the show is called Tilt. Oh, that's what that is? That's Tilt? Well, I know it's the blank blank. Do you know the year and the core? If so, that's worth five points. If not, that's okay. Uh, I'm going to tell you right now, it's 2014. And they got second place. So who got second place in 2014 with the show Tilt? You know, it's the... Uh, if not... That's okay, but if you do know what core it is, you got yourself three points. If not, let's check it out right now. Coats, we knew it, uh, and we are all set. That's the final round. That's all I've got for you. Seven rounds, uh, seven chances to get some points. So I need you to tally up your points. Comment with what you got. Comment with what you knew. Comment with what you didn't. Comment with what you want to see. Think this was cool. Think I need to weigh the pointing system different. Think I actually thought too much about this and I should get a different hobby. Who knows? Why don't you comment with it? And uh, we'll see what we're going to do next time. Uh, DCI Finals is coming up. I'm going to be there. Make sure to hit the bell to get notifications because I will go live when cool things happen. Uh, I will be posting a full uh, In The Lot lineup that weekend, um, hopefully before finals. Actually, I'll probably post that week Friday night. I'll be filming all day for quarterfinals In The Lot. You'll see every single one I can get and I'll be up all night editing, and that's okay, because y'all need to be there. It's the best sound in the world. Uh, I think that's it. This has been really fun. Uh, I'ma see y'all real soon. I can't wait to see how you did on this quiz. I know you've been looking forward to this for a while, so uh, I hope you liked it. Uh, that's it for me. I have an album. It's called Half Man, Half Machine. It's available on iTunes, Spotify, and Google Play, but y'all knew that. Uh, but did you know it sounds a little something like...